Hey guys, thank you so much for clicking on this video. So this review has been long overdue. I've had this hair for some months now and it is time to come and give you all the tea, fax you all the tea, let y'all know what's going on with this hair that I got from Amazon. If you are an avid shopper of hair like myself, then you know that a lot of these hair companies from AliExpress, DHgate, basically any overseas hair company, they've recently migrated on over to Amazon.com, which is definitely clutch for consumers like myself because I have Amazon Prime and I like my two day shipping. So whenever I do order hair extensions, I know that within two to three days, I'll have my hair extensions in my hand, ready to make a wig, ready to install, all of that good stuff. And if I end up not liking my product or if I don't receive my product, I have no issue as far as getting a refund or having the product actually sent out to me because you know Amazon they're really big on customer service so whatever company that they do end up having a contract with or whatnot you know Amazon definitely steps in if there are any issues when it comes down to shipping I really like the fact that a lot of these companies that are overseas have contracts or have warehouses with Amazon and I could get my hair like that because I'm gonna just be honest a lot of the hair that's on Amazon, a lot of the companies came from AliExpress or DHK, okay? Let's be clear. So I really don't have like a high expectation for hair from Amazon at all because I know the deal already. I really know what I'm getting myself into and blah, blah, blah. This hair comes from Amazon. It's from the hair company, Maxine Hair Company, and this is their Malaysian Water Wave hair. I have in four bundles of their hair along with the matching lace closure that I turn into a wig. This is two bundles of 28 inch, a bundle of 26, and one of 24 inches, and a 20 inch matching lace closure. This is the hair in its natural color, and this is the hair in its natural pattern. All I do is pretty much co-wash the hair with conditioner. I use Aussie Moist brand of conditioner to co-wash, and I let it air dry. And afterwards, all I use is just some soft holding mousse in water in a spray bottle. And I saturate, like I, I drench this hair with the little mixture. And I run my powder brush through the hair once again, even after I co-wash it and let it air dry. And I let it air dry once again. And it almost always turns out like this. This has been my go-to wig for the past few months. Every time I wear it, people are just asking like, what kind of hair do you have in? What pattern is that? I've tried a lot of water wave hair. My favorite origin, I would have to say, even though people are like, oh, there's no such thing as Brazilian, Peruvian, and all that other stuff. There, there's some, there's, there has got to be some type of difference between these origins. I get so confused when it comes down to that, but maybe it is true about what a lot of people are saying. It's just a marketing gimmick, so whatever. But from my experience, Malaysian and Indian water wave hair is just amazing. This hair definitely has got to be my ultimate, ultimate favorite water wave hair. I know I'm gonna get questions about, what about this company, what about the, that company? I'm telling you right now. If I had to choose which company had the best water wave hair that I've tried so far, it'll be VIP Beauty, then this one. And after that, it really doesn't matter because these are my top two. So shedding does occur with this hair when it comes down to me co-washing. I never run a brush or a comb through this hair while it's dry. Only when I'm co-washing or when I am saturating the hair with my water and mousse mixture. Just to kind of define the curls a bit so that it'll end up drying like this. Tangles, tangles do happen. They do occur in the nape. It's inevitable, it's wavy curly hair, it's going to happen, and they're super long lengths, so the hair is rubbing up against my clothes and my skin, it's going to happen. That really doesn't take away from the fact that I do really enjoy wearing my wig. Um, wearing this hair, pretty much. I don't know what else to tell you guys, other than the fact that I do do, I do do. <laughs> I really do love this hair. This 
is by far my favorite, favorite pattern. They, oh my God. I don't know why I'm so chit chatty. It's been such a long time since I've sat down and recorded a video. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Have you ever ordered hair from Amazon? Let me know what your experience was. As for me, in my house, we will continue to shop on Amazon for our hair weaves and extensions and things of that sort because Prime is what? Clutch. But anyways, I hope you guys have a great day. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.